मुर्तजा आपको आपके सिलेक्शन के लिए यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ वेस्टर्न ऑन्टोरियो के लिए बहुत बहुत बधाई है थैंक यू सर जरा अपने बारे में बताएंगे प्रतिभा अपने फैमिली बैकग्राउंड अपने एजुकेशनल बैकग्राउंड के लिए हाँ या सर श्योर सर एजुकेशन आई डिड माई मास्टर्स in mathematics in mm-hmm. 2020 from mayur regional university okay and from my background so i'm from a background i mean i'm from a small town and my family occupation is farming acha yeah sir kahan se aapki family kahan se belong karti hai yeah sir actually my family belongs to haryana haryana ka haryana bada state in uh, We live in a small town uh, at Faridabad in Haryana. आपने बीएससी कहाँ से किया? Yes, sir. I did my bachelor's from Guru Nanak Girls College from Yamuna Nagar. अच्छा. And uh, yeah, and it is affiliated from Guru Chitra University. क्या परसेंटेज थी आपकी बीएससी में? हाँ, uh, I scored around eight point zero four CGPA. और उसके बाद आप आंदोलन रचना चलेगी मास्टर्स करने के लिए आपने मैथमेटिक्स फील्ड ही क्यों चूज की सर एक्चुअली फ्रॉम माय चाइल्डहुड और फ्रॉम माय स्कूल टाइम हाई स्कूल आई मीन आई फील वेरी लाइक आई लाइक वेरी आई मीन आई लाइक वेरी अप्लाइड सब्जेक्ट्स आई लव प्ले विद प्ले विद वर्ड्स एंड मैथमेटिक्स इज रियली फैसिनेटिंग सब्जेक्ट फॉर मी सो इट्स लुक आई मीन इजी और इट्स लाइक अ कप ऑफ टी फॉर मी आई वुड से ओके नाइस मैंने बहुत कम स्टूडेंट फीमेल्स देखे हैं जो कि मैथमेटिक्स फील्ड में रहते हैं इसलिए आई वाज क्यूरियस टू नो सो वर यू इंस्पायर्ड बाय सम इंडियन मैथमेटिशियन और समथिंग लाइक दैट सर एक्चुअली व्हेन आई वाज इन माय पोस्ट ग्रेजुएशन एंड ड्यूरिंग माय मास्टर्स रिसर्च प्रोजेक्ट आई फील समथिंग लाइक डूइंग some new research in mathematics is just like a uh, getting knowledge about new things is just like a i mean do something uh, mm-hmm. apart from your basic knowledge uh, okay. so i really inspired by my supervisor <laughs> see as okay. a uh, i i think he has a great role in it okay. so basically you were inspired by your थीसिस सुपरवाइजर एंड एंड टू लीव ओके तो आपने पीएचडी करने का कब सोचा कि यू वांट टू गो टू कनाडा टू स्टार्ट योर पीएचडी कब दिमाग में आया आपके आह यस सर आई वुड से आई मीन लास्ट ईयर ओह लास्ट ईयर ओके तो जब आपके दिमाग में आया तो क्या किया आपने कैसे किया जाए yeah so actually when i thought uh, like to continue my so while searching out through the google i got some information like for some universities in abroad like gre is required so i started preparation for gre that's and right. uh, luckily when when i was about to give, take my gre test i got a chance um, through your page and then i talked with you and you told me like gr is wave off for the year 2022 mm-hmm. then i started preparation for ielts and mm-hmm. i gave i gave my ielts in january and then i filled my application in february and i got selected uh, what was your score in ielts ah uh, yeah so actually my ielts score wasn't that much good i <laughs> scored overall 6 <six> then <laughs> <laughs> Okay okay so how did you prepare yeah. in, a, in how many days sir actually my preparation uh, like for one month i only mm-hmm. prepared for one month ielts and yeah my preparation was about very good i mean i did approximately good in all four modules mm-hmm. but yeah unfortunately i didn't i mean i didn't um, perform so good in reading mm-hmm. बहुत 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, actually, it was the time of um, in the month of November in 2021. Mm-hmm. I was just scrolling on Instagram page and and uh, I came across uh, let's do GRE page on Instagram mm-hmm. and where I did some like uh, masters and PhD programs with fully funded scholarship. So mm-hmm. I was thinking to go through that page. Mm-hmm. And while I was go th- while I was going through that page. Uh, I look my, I mean, my college friends, Himani, on Himani, your, yes, yes. Yeah, on your Insta post, Insta post that, uh, and I thoroughly search your Insta, yeah, Insta. <laughs> okay. Some and within twenty minutes you <laughs> revived me, yeah, you revived me and you gave me your WhatsApp number. Then mm-hmm. we talked about. We talked about the mass uh, about the PhD and um, yeah that was the great criteria uh, that uh, I came into your contact. Okay, so but how you trusted uh, me or our platform and why you trusted yes, it is online? We never met. Yes, uh, to be very honest. Uh, I would say uh, I was a girl who never <laughs> trusted on online platforms. <laughs> but when I, <laughs> yes, so frankly, I would say, but, but when I see my friends, she's like Himani, she's, she was my, she's my college friend. So, mm-hmm. and I know like she got selected in USA, USA's university. So that, I mean, Himani played a much role by much believing role. in you. <laughs> yeah, Himani got two US selections last year. So that was the key criteria. Okay. And let's talk about your selection to University of Western Ontario. But I process the application. okay, sir. Actually, sir, uh, when I talked to you, like shared some uni- uh, some shortlist, shortlist universities. Then I searched thoroughly eight or nine university, and I selected only Western University. <laughs> I was very interested by the program <laughs> of Western. Mm-hmm. Uh, like I filled my application on last date. Yes, I remember that. I think video is paused. Yeah, but the, I think it's audio. It's still okay. So you keep keep on talking. Hello, sir. Am I audible, sir? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, sir. Actually, there is a mobile glitch in my uh, area, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes we yeah. got yeah. lost. That's okay. Yes, yeah, yes. sir. Okay, so, sir. So, so, yeah, continue, please. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, sir, I was talking like I filled my application on last date. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, after filling my application, uh, I got messages from uh, uh, universities after 14 days I mean after 14 days I got an email like uh, I got I has passed the preliminary assessment and uh, I would be informed uh, within two weeks when the university take any decision mm-hmm. so like uh, so after four or five days I got a message from a professor who yeah who showed uh, who showed his interest in my uh, in my profile, mm-hmm. and then uh, he scheduled a meeting, Zoom meeting, mm-hmm. and uh, he talked about my research, whatever I did in my master's thesis, and mm-hmm. um, yeah, he was very impressed with my work and with my passion about PhD, and then he gave me a positive response, and uh, and the next day I got a message from the university, then yes, I got a. I, mm-hmm. And what was yes, our role? Was so what was our role in, in this application process? Can you elaborate on that? Yeah, sir. Mainly I would say the professor also like mentioned it like your SOP is very strong and your profile is mm-hmm. I, and you have mentioned everything in your SOP. So your profile looks very attractive. Your academic score is very good. So I would say, I mean, SOP has played a great role and uh, all, I mean, all, I would say oh, all credit goes to you because SOP all, is prepared by you. <laughs> <That's> okay. <why. laughs> all right, thank you. Now, how about CV? 
and CV was also then well answered. What sir? I didn't get you sir. Uh, how about the CV? Uh, CV construction yes, is sir, also important. Yes, the CV construction is also the important part. You have shared yes. our uh, WhatsApp document and yes. about how to make it. Then I yes. I work on it and I make it. It's true. <laughs> and it yeah. was very fascinating and attracting. <laughs> <laughs> and how about interview mock mock interview? Yeah, interview lasts upon the forty minutes. Yes. Yeah. So, so does our mock interview help in the? In some sense, for the real interview. Yes, yeah, sir. Definitely, I got the. Yes, yeah, sir. Definitely, it played a great role because I got a. I got a so much confidence, confidence. when you talk like I'm a good speaker, and you would you would ask yeah. some. Yes. yes. Yeah, before before the meeting, I was like, how would I give my meeting, and how would I respond? I was mm -hmm. like, I mean, there are a lot of question in my mind, but after after the meeting. After mm -hmm. you have taken the meeting, I was like, now I can, I can do well. <laughs> so it so, was a great improvement. Yes. Yeah. So your confidence was boosted. Yeah, yeah. Confidence yeah. played a great role. So. Very, very true. So when you had interaction with the professor at Western Ontario, did he ask some technical question? What kind of discussion was it? Uh, sir, firstly, uh, sir has asked some questions about my MS, uh, MS. Project or MSc research work, mm -hmm. and after that, sir, uh, sir had given some detailed uh, knowledge about PhD program, what we are about to do, PhD mm -hmm. program about first year, and then about research work, and then sir asked about my research work, like I did research work in pure mathematics. So sir yes. asked question about why, why do you want to uh, do research in applied mathematics as you did, as you have, as you had, uh, I mean. Done some work in pure mathematics. Mm -hmm. Okay. After that, I asked some basic questions like uh, how I mean, what the life of students in Western University and about weather and about the flexibility of time, mm -hmm. like that. And um, yes. okay. So now you will be working with the professor as an RE research assistant in the field of. Biological, right? Biology and mathematics. So, mathematical biology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> biological mathematics. Yeah, which is quite interesting field, and I think it holds. Yeah, a good so it, it's a quite interesting field. Yeah, That's yeah, true. it goes. It takes to great future. Yeah, yeah. Sir. and you will be RA. Uh, it means you will uh, working uh, in the research environment towards your thesis right from the beginning, which is yeah, which is good right. thing okay. as well. So let's talk about the scholarship. So can you tell us about the scholarship, your monthly stipend? Yeah, sir, actually, uh, like, uh, if I talk about my scholarship, so they have mentioned the, uh, about per year scholarship. So mm -hmm. like, it, it's just like $18,196 per year, plus yeah. some teaching uh, TA and some other uh, Funded, which I got like if I do if I take part if I would take some participate in um, conferences then I they would also funded uh, they would also fund uh, funded PhD students like mm -hmm. that yes yes and also your tuition is waived right so it's a full full scholarship yeah you yeah it's the fully pay. funded yeah sir yeah. it's a fully funded program yes sir so, <laughs> <laughs> to be very frank or to be very honest, I would say <laughs> at that night I was so excited and I didn't get sleep well. <laughs> uh, very true. And you applied only in, in only one university. Just yeah, just sir, I only applied one application. Uh, because you were interested in Canada, very specific to the place. So uh, I would what would Budhai again? Okay. I think obviously uh, we have our direction as well. So, but it plays a yes. critical role how you decided uh, uh, your future Yes, sir, goals. A, a, right direction, a right direction is the main part or is a key to success. Yes, quite true. Aap kuch kehna chahenge motivation ke tawar pe. Bahut sari student ko 
जो बाहर जाके स्टडी करना चाहते हैं कैसे हमारे थ्रू कैन वी कंट्रीब्यूट टू देयर सक्सेस के डू वांट टू से समथिंग अबाउट यस सर डेफिनेटली एक्चुअली when like like i was wondering about last for the one for the last one year like what the process how we do things to take admission in abroad university and i was searching for fully funded and i talked to like uh, i mean i i talked about more than 10 or 11 consultants but they oh. didn't give me a right response yeah they always manipulate things like uh, they didn't uh, like uh, they didn't help students for phd you have to talk directly with the supervisors mm-hmm. and um, like they always talk like you should take another uh, another subject and you would mm-hmm. go for ms or mba they are saying mm-hmm. what's the process and uh, definitely i would say i got a right direction through your platform Mm-hmm. so i would say if if the student want to continue their career in abroad so they should go through your page and through your guidance gu- guidance it would be really okay yeah uh, thank you thank you so much i mean you seem very cheerful and, and very happy while talking <laughs> <laughs> well yeah uh, so next step will be uh, visa process once document arrives we will help you through the the visa process and and any further help guidance you need to, to i think uh, there is some network <laughs> can you hear me now yeah sir actually the video is pausing so i am not able to hear you properly acha acha main keh raha tha ki ab next step will be visa processing and Canada yeah, visa. Yeah, yeah, we will guide you through once document arrive, and we will shoot for the visa guidance and the visa processing. So yes, sir. I have a question. Like I have shared the, I have shared the conditions the university uh, like keep about the like e transcript. We have to share e transcript through the registrar of our college. Okay. So what the process? Yeah. And second part it about. Yes, yes. So let me stop this video and we continue. Okay. Yes, yeah, <laughs> definitely. Okay. Yeah. <laughs>